Good, wonderful, beautiful morning, body dance. Look at you. You're up on the couch. Look, your leg's not so red. Look, it looks beautiful. You're doing good? How are you feeling, huh? Everybody's worried about you. She's like, I feel pretty good. Look how cute I am. She's actually been jumping up and down off the couch. She's been making it up and down the steps a lot easier since Jamie fixed them. I think we're definitely going in the right direction, huh, Miss Oakley? She's like, yep, we're going in the right direction. I feel amazing. <laughs> Memphis is like, hey, camera time for me? You want camera time too? I know, you do too. How are you feeling? You feeling good? <laughs> All right, let's get this day started. So last night at about 10.30, <laughs> um, everybody that's connected to city water lost water pressure. And we all kind of didn't know why. This morning when we woke up, there was notifications all over Facebook. Don't drink the water, boil water. Uh, there's a boil water notification because the water main broke and they're afraid that groundwater may have gotten into the water system and contaminated the water system. So as a precaution, they're having everybody boil water. So, the dogs are being spoiled today. Before everybody else ran and bought it all up, <laughs> we ran to the store and we br we bought four jugs of water. Greg grabbed a couple as well for his cats um, so that we can give them water without having to boil it. Uh, these were, of course, bottled before the boil water thing. So the dogs are drinking bottled water today because apparently, you know, I don't want them to get sick. I mean, I'm sure they could probably handle it better than we could because their digestive systems are a lot shorter and they handle bacteria better than people do, but I don't need the dogs to get anything from bad water, so they're drinking bottled water until further notice. We do have, like, I have the pure water filters and everything, but they say even with those, you should still boil the water, so. I guess that is what's going on today. Boil water, don't drink the water! I feel like we live in Flint. Those of you from Michigan will get it. It's another rainy day here in northern Michigan. If the temperature would just drop about four degrees, this rain would turn to snow. Paws crossed, maybe it'll happen by the time it gets dark. We would really appreciate some snow anytime soon. You love the fact that you can come right in this door and the tree jar is right here where you always turn around anyway. You're like, Mom, you put the tree jar in the perfect spot. Okay, ready? Take nice, ready? Oh, good job. Good job. Would you like a treat? Oh, good job. How about you, Shelby? You want one? Shelby's like, yeah, bring it to me. Would you like one? Here you go. There you go. Oh, really? Here, try again. Oh, it's amazing. There you go. <laughs> She's like, be more excited about the cookie or else I am not eating it. <laughs> so I dropped a memory card down in the couch and I took the couch cushion off to look for it and somebody thinks it's a new dog bed. Are you kidding me, Memphis? Are you kidding me right now? What are you doing? Can I have that couch cushion back so I can put it back on the couch? <laughs> Oh, you're silly. <gasps> Look what's happening! All that rain is finally going to turn to snow. And it's cold enough out there to stick. This literally just started. It was barely, barely snowing earlier, but holy man. Now it's a blizzard. Oh, it is. It's already accumulating out there, too. Sweet! I'm currently getting ready to make dog treats, which I feel like I haven't done in a month, and I actually think it's been a month since I've uploaded a dog treat video. Just because everything crazy was going on with the dogs, we had so much going on, I didn't make any treats. But I'm gonna make some Thanksgiving-themed treats. It's like Thanksgiving dinner as a treat for dogs. So it's the first time doing this, we'll see how it turns out. Hopefully they like it. They usually like everything I make anyway, so. <laughs> Go ahead, Shelby. Tell your story. So we all got the stories to tell. We're going to wait for you to finish telling your story. Yeah. She wants to play with her so bad. She's like, just play with me. I haven't been able to play. Play with me. <laughs> okay, can we hear Greg's story now? Yeah, can we listen to Greg? <laughs> No, he's not done. They're also excited because I have all this stuff over here for treats. Ooh, let's try this. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, fine. Hey. She's like, oh, I would. You want cranberry? Cranberry? Yeah. Is she going to eat it? No. <laughs> she ain't going to eat it. I wouldn't either. Don't eat a whole cranberry. She's like, I don't know. Oh, there she goes. She's like a little Here. Want cranberry? It's not that good, honey. You want? 
Memphis was like, mm, I don't oh, know. Oh, she ate it. Memphis yep. ate it. Yep, it was Did you eat it? You were licking your lips like you no. ate it. Mm -hmm. No, she spit it out. It's, it's yeah. probably a little tart for just food. Not for Memphis. Look at Memphis is chewing it up. She's like, it's food, I should probably eat it. Yeah, she's so like, hmm, this is pretty good. Oh, now she's going to play with it? Are you going to play with that cranberry? Play with it. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Hold on, I get it, I get it. There, we got it. We're gonna try to eat it again. Oh, and it's gone. Yeah, she ate it. Man. She played with it, and she ate it. <laughs> Is it good, huh? It was delicious. Hi, Greg. So, I get, I can kind of tell you the story while on camera, but I'm not gonna tell the whole thing. I'm just gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you a story about our new cooking channel. Okay. <laughs> When we're starting? Uh, possibly. It might be sooner than we thought. Why? Because we can. Why? Because we can. That's a good thing. Yeah. Because the holidays are coming and people are going to want food for the holidays, so shouldn't we figure out food for the holidays to make yeah. for people? I have a list of holidays. Cookies. Yep. So I have a plan, but I, it's still kind of a secret from the vlog. We gotta get rid of this. Th that's part of the plan. That's part of the plan. That might actually happen as soon as tomorrow. Let me know because what? I have to, I mean, I have to order an that's apron. Oh, we should. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, I already got my maid. Okay. It's on, uh, how do you look at the, what's that? Spreadshirt. All right, we'll have to do right that. Right up there. Okay. I'm going to tell. Not on your spreadsheet. They can't get it yet. Right. Oh, we'll have to do that, too. no access yet. <laughs> so we actually are starting a cooking channel. I will put a link to it down in the video description below. There's like one short little video up there basically saying, hey, this is happening eventually. You guys have been asking for it. We figured we, we might as well do it. Greg's going to be a part of it as well. So it's going to be the three of us. And uh, we'll tell you more about it soon. Hopefully real soon. Oh, my goodness. Did you guys get exhausted while we were making treats? You're like, oh, this is taking so long. We're so hungry. It's, it smells so good. We're so hungry. We're so tired. <laughs> Even Oakley's like, come on, cook the cookies. So they're turning out pretty good. I haven't baked them yet. Look at they look like little turkeys. I'm cutting out a bunch of little turkeys, and then I'm also gonna do some little bones as well. And then we'll bake them and see uh see how they turn out. Are you winking at me? Is that some kind of code? Are you trying to tell me something? <laughs> Look at all the cookies! So they turned out pretty cute. And they're actually like really super crunchy too. I left them in the oven for a little bit after they were done cooking and uh, made them nice and crunchy. So that video is going to be up on the dogs channel if you guys want to know how to make Thanksgiving Day dinner cookies for dogs. Look at that little girl snuggled up in her kennel. Oh, she's dreaming too. See her ears twitching? Her face is twitching too. I know she's dreaming. She's laying on her incision, so it must not hurt too bad. Hopefully. <laughs> Look at her little face twitch. Gosh, you're so cute. See, you got your big raccoon in there, huh? You like not having a door on your kennel. It makes it nice, it makes it easy to get in and out of. Even after she gets her stitches out, we're not going to put it back on. We're going to leave it off. Just makes it easier for her. Hey, where did all the other puppies go that were just right here? I missed your biggest yawn ever because I pushed the wrong button on the camera. All right, you guys, we're going to call it a night, and we're going to go to bed. You want to go to bed? Yeah, look how tired you are. Oh, my goodness. Uh, all right, you guys, if you're new to this channel and you like what you saw, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and share it with your friends to help us grow the audience. As always, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive. Dream big. And we will see you again soon. Good night, audience. You don't want to go to bed. You want to go outside, don't you? Okay, you can go. it's not snowing anymore, but you can go outside. <laughs> Good night, guys.